Thank you for joining my embossing paste techniques class. We'll be making 12 different techniques, samples, which is a continuation of 48 other techniques that we've done previously. So today we'll be working on 49 through 60. We'll be using white embossing paste and we'll be using the palette knives, which come in a set of three. And we'll be using these masks, Pattern Party Decorative Masks, which are discontinued right now. But uh, basic pattern decorative masks are current in our catalog. There are three different styles of knives, which gives you a variety of ways that you can uh, make different textures with the paste. The paste does need to be closed up. There's foil lid. Be sure and close it each time to save your paste. Using a silicone sheet under helps clean up. Now the masks do get a little bit stained from the paste, but it doesn't affect the ability to use them over and over again. Just smooth with a knife to get the paste. Um, just smooth it until you get the results that you want. Be sure to clean off the mask quickly. And then we let the, the clouds We'll set it aside and let the clouds dry. For our next technique, what we're going to do is we're going to use our Big Shot and cut out a shape. And you can do this with any shape you wish to use. We're going to smooth the paste over our die cut shape until we're happy with the results. Then we're going to let it dry. We're going to set it aside. Now you can color your paste if you want with reinker. But I wanted to show you you can get any shape you would like. We're going to use shaded spruce. And go ahead, after it's dry, we're going to go ahead and ink up our leaf. Gives a nice, fun effect. 